some are calling it an entry level suv some are calling it a sub compact suv while many are calling it a micro suv what really matters is the fact that this suv has really rattled the competition in the sub 4 meter segment in india meet the hyundai extra the smallest and most affordable suv from the house of the south korean automaker an suv that promises many first in segment features and i am in this beautiful location of jaipur to understand what this car offers on the top of the rivals in the indian market so what exactly is hyundai extra well it's a new sub 4 meter suv that sits below the venue in the product lineup of hyundai and uh, offers a length of more than 3800 mm on the other hand the venue is about 4 meters in length a bit shy of 4 meters to be very precise in terms of competition this rivals the tata punch and the citroen c3 both of which identifies as the sub compact suv so the hyundai extra is the newest sub compact SUV in the Indian market. The Extra sits below Venue, another sub 4 meter SUV in the Hyundai's product lineup. Since Venue is sold as a compact SUV, this can be called a sub compact SUV. But many are calling it a micro SUV comparing it against the Maruti Suzuki Ignis sold through the Nexa dealership, which in my opinion is not a right comparison as Ignis is a hatchback. Now the very first thing that comes to my mind after looking at the Hyundai Extra is how young and peppy it looks as compared to the competition. While I really like the rear profile of this SUV which gives it a bulk appeal, I don't like the front profile because it snatches away that feeling of an SUV that customer demands in a market like India. Rather, it looks like a premium hatchback from the front. The rear is a different ball game altogether. Also, there's a sticker saying six airbag standard, which we talk in a bit from now. You get a thin black line connecting the H-shaped headlights, followed by the extra name, and then a not so big grill. There's also a skid plate at the front. The drooping profile fails to give the extra a big SUV appeal. However, the back is a different ball game altogether, as you get an old school large black colored. plate connecting the tail lamps and a large skid plate as well at the sides are the large blacked out wheel arches and roof rails sitting at 185 mm of ground clearance and offering nine color options the extra is surely a refined looking small suv Hyundai has always been at the forefront of launching feature rich cars in India and the Extra is no less. Despite being the smallest and most affordable SUV from the brand, it gets all the bells and whistles one can ask from a car in this segment. Well, the Hyundai Extra gets an expensive list of features. The three highlights for me is the sunroof, integration of dashcam here that can be used for selfie and standard 6 airbags all of which are not offered by the competition in fact the sunroof here is voice controlled here listen sunroof kholo opening the sunroof here you go you also get features like cool glove box 8 inch infotainment system with blue link connected car functionality among many other things in terms of safety the car also gets esp esc tpms and stuff anyone who's looking to buy an suv over the hatchback is looking for practicality and in that sense the hyundai extra provides a credible offering to the buyers gets a large space inside the cabin and that is decent enough for five full grown adults the boot is rated at 391 liter which is one of the biggest not only in the sub compact suv segment but also in a segment above it's also deep to stack your large bags so i'm driving the hyundai extra and uh, the south korean automaker is offering two engine options with this car one is a 1.2 liter petrol and the other one is a 1.2 liter petrol with a cng kit Now the one we are driving is the pure petrol engine 1.2 liter that produces 83 PS of power and 140 Newton meter of torque. And uh, in terms of gearbox options, you get a five-speed MT, which I'm driving, and a five-speed AMT gearbox. Now the biggest USP of this car is that Hyundai Extra has become the first ever car in India where pedal shifters are being offered with the AMT gearbox, and that'll entice. 
the person who is looking to buy a car for performance as well as mileage while the petrol delivers 19.2 kmpl mileage the cng delivers 27.1 km per kg mileage the hyundai extra offers a very planted ride quality and 185 mm ground clearance combined with refined suspension soaking in most of the bumps the steering was on the lighter side as per my liking but that has been the case with almost all the hyundai cars overall the hyundai extra is a great package for those looking to spend less than rupees 10 lakh but want a car that is high on practicality features and comfort the hyundai extra is priced at rupees 6 lakh which is exactly similar to tata punch and a bit less than the citroen c3 at this price point you are getting a car which looks like a younger suv and offers a lot of features to the potential buyers so if you are out there in the market looking for your next big car then hyundai extra should be on the top of your list giving the amount of Uh, features and things that you are getting in this new car